Steven Bienville and I uh, am ready to go but I picked a place to go to last night and then I put it in my navigation system and it's a three hour drive and I'm not up to that so I have to pick a location that is a bit closer by like an hour's drive I think that's enough for today so I will uh, look in the book and see if I can find a location a bit closer and uh, hopefully I will find some nice surroundings <laughs> Spotted the first Dutchman, and it's not even a tourist. <laughs> So I just drove into the Dordogne and as soon as I pass a sign the landscape changed from rain, 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 sunflower grain to grapes. <laughs> so I'm taking a break here, just eating something and then moving on. All these towns are like little ghost towns. You don't see anybody. Every once in a while, a car is passing, but that's it. Gums. That all. Bourgogne, not Dordogne. Bourgogne. Glamessi. So 
So I just drove to the, the park, parking spot for the campus and there's a sign there uh, forbidden to park for campus. So I think that has changed and now I just drove down the street and I parked over there but I'm, I don't think I'm supposed to park there, you know. Look at that, I'm over there. So I just walked through the town and I found another parking spot and it's for free and it's next to uh, some uh, toilets, well they're in the neighborhood so I'm gonna get my camper and then I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna park there or maybe I can drive through this alley, I will check it. This alley is a bit small. I'm not taking that chance. So tomorrow is July 14th and it's a big celebration day here in France. So now that I'm in Glemacy, uh I hope to see, well, some extra things and some fireworks and such. And that's why I'm staying here. So I'm taking currently taking a walk, I'm just checking out the area, and it all looks okay. It looks uh, really peaceful. I walked a bit through town and I ate something across over there in the garden and now I installed myself with a glass of wine and a book.